perfect. Awesome. Wow. My name is Rochelle Ballard. And Rochelle, how long have you been teaching this class? Sup yoga? Yes. This is my first time. Wow, it, you, we couldn't tell because it seems like you're, you've been a veteran of this. What inspired you to, st to start teaching this type of class? Uh, Wonderlust. They asked me to do it and I thought, oh, that sounds like a fun fun style of uh, teaching yoga. So, you know, I agreed to it and I, I love just playing around on myself and, and, you know, paddling into waves and going on downwind runs. And so, you know, just really put, applying it onto a board and, and I teach yoga on a regular basis. I think that, you know, surfing helps a lot. Yeah, I was going to say, what, what are the core strengths that you think are vital to make sure that you're successful at this? Well, it's really like when you have quick muscle twitch memory and there's also longer holds. Mm -hmm. And so what happens for surfers and particularly with stand-up is that because you're, you're stabilizing everything in balance, those quick muscle twitch memory um, in the muscles can hold for longer periods rather than fatigue so quickly. Okay. And so it's easier to stabilize in yoga like that. You know, if you're new to it, everything's going to shake and it's going to feel awkward. Sure. And it's a little bit harder to balance, but once you start getting the hang of it and doing it on a regular basis, you know, then those muscles slowly start to build and feel that integrity in there. Then you can start to feel the length and play around with it a bit more. part of the elements and feel them, you know, that's when you're the union of it. And that's what yoga is, is like, you know, it's removing obstacles, it's feeling how the body moves with the breath. And then in surfing, it's the same thing, you know, the same thing applies. It's, it's being able to move with your breath and to be able to feel the rhythm of the ocean and to be able to feel its power and its strength and, and use it in a way that you're honoring it instead of fighting it. You know, and, and fear is really the unknown. Once you start to feel comfortable with anything, it's ocean knowledge and, and it's a deep, beautiful relationship that you continue to build. Learning new things in the ocean, uh, the new discoveries, and I feel like it's the same thing with yoga. So I really enjoy the combination of the two things. And it just makes the body feel good and it's complimentary. One of the best things that I love to make my body feel good is jumping in the ocean and having a surf. You know, and sometimes it's calming down and just doing a little